Good morning. Cha cha cha. All right, guys. Let's let's talk about it. So, I didn't realize. I thought I had gotten all my packages, and I didn't. But I got my last ones because when I ordered the uh, the Star Wars five pack mail call, uh, I didn't realize I ordered a few other ones that came with it, but they just came in a different package. And then you know, as you're Christmas shopping uh, for people that you love you find some scores so these I believe are the last of my collection unless I miss something well you know what let me start off first drag up coffee love it and I told you guys I ordered wholesale because everybody's getting coffee for Christmas this is actually going out to somebody very near and dear and one of my my first uh, followers on tick 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 tock um Sancho and salted caramel. I'm gonna crack open a bag of Christmas tree when I'm done with these that I have already brewing. But let me tell you, you guys know I'm a huge Star Wars fan, right? Uh, I'm such a nerd, I know. I don't really even drink hot coffee anymore, but when I do, are some tea at the house and it's the holidays. I know, I know, I know, madness. So. I grew up in East LA, typical Mexican household. My Nina would make the super hot salsa once or twice a year, but a staple in our house. And my cousin Claudia's husband, uh, Jesse, who's my brother from another mother. <laughs> the tapio Now, you know what's funny is I got this, like all my collection, as funny as it seems, some of them aren't worth a lot of money. Some of them are. But everything I have has a special meaning to my heart, whether it's a connection to my, my kids, my childhood, or, you know, something that I really, really love, like Star Wars. Now, this one is going to be for all my 80 babies. All I want is my MTV. <laughs> you remember when they had actual videos? I don't know if anybody remembers when Michael Jackson dropped Thriller. Like, it was an event in the neighborhood. We all watched it at my sister's best friend's house because they had the big screen TV and the surround sound. Um, and I remember when they actually had videos and, uh, when you would actually have to wait, uh, Carson Daly, uh, you just, you know, I mean, growing up and we didn't have cable growing up Well, we had a black box, but, uh, you know, when my, I go to my aunts or my, uh, my Nina's and they would have cable there or, you know, our friends would have cable or I remember watching the first, uh, one of the first WrestleManias at my buddy Juan's house, they had a black box and all of us went over there. It was a big event. And, uh. I saw this and I couldn't resist. All I want is my MTV. All right, guys, this is where it gets exciting for me. Uh, so growing up, we were on Section 8 and welfare. I didn't know it at the time, uh, but there was one thing that we got every month, at least one box, because it was my absolute favorite. And I just could not freaking believe when I saw it. And it was on sale for 99 cents. Captain Crunch. So, yeah, that, that grew that one right there. And then, bam! So I actually have a bigger Thanos up there, and I have a smaller Iron Man. So I got the smaller Thanos to match the Iron Man. And we are going to see where that goes. I've actually came up to the decision that I'm going to have to rearrange my collection. Because I, I like things to match. Like, I have the... The good and the evil of all the major character stories that I have. I also have my Disney collection. I have uh, uh, pop memorabilia stuff that's important to me. Like I said, it's a really personal collection. But you guys know, this is where the... This is the original concept of what Darth Vader was supposed to look like. I've never seen it. And the fact that it was on sale, had to grab it, Black Friday. This is the uh, exclusive uh, Disney Star Wars 45. This is the concept series. This is what he was supposed to look like versus... I am your father. And you know what's funny is, I don't know if I actually... I think Darth Vader was actually the unsung hero of the series. And the funny thing is... Uh, that's what I tell people and they kind of look at me weird, but I think, you know, the arc of being the father and, you know, 
feeling that the force turned against him, at least the, the Jedi and the power and just, I can go on forever and ever. But that is it for my Funko collection and mail call today. So I appreciate everybody. When you get a chance, hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, I do random videos about everything from happiness. I struggle with my mental health. I put that out there. I'm just being as real as I humanly can so people know where I'm at. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. It's priceless. It's free. And I promise you, it will change the world one random act of kindness at a time. And the last thing I found, I always choose kindness, guys. We need it more than ever. And uh, I promise you, it makes a world of difference. Even if it's just to yourself, you can change the world one random act of kindness at a time. Bye.